up guys so welcome back to the channel so today i'm working on the em1 so i got a few parts in haven't recorded in a while so i'm gonna do that today hopefully get this done before it rains but uh these fg2 seats are finally coming out still undecided on the rear half of the interior but here is some pom rails sort of pre-assembled they don't come pre-assembled i've sort of got them assembled so far so I'm going to start pulling this driver's side seat out. I only have rails for the driver's side. But then as soon as I get the rails in, I'll show you what seats are going in here. So stay tuned. transfer this over to the seat rail which just has a bracket and a nut I'm hoping it's the same thread pitch because uh, it didn't come with anything to put in place of it and I am noticing an issue with it already uh, and I'll show you so I can put it here I guess and use it as a stopper but if I put it like this or something um, well, it's going to be in the way. I'm going to try to just angle it like so. And hopefully that'll work. We'll see. So, I have found something I don't like about the rails. So, I've got three bolts in them right now. i got to find the other bolt real quick and put it in. But this one is not bad. That one's not bad. This one, the washer fell in. So I'm gonna have to adjust that and retighten it, but the supplied washers just don't seem to be big enough at all, really. And it should have came with a lot more because it really could have used washers under each of the locking nuts. But so I'm gonna finish bolting down the rails. I just vacuumed out the carpet, not perfect. And then uh, I'll go inside and get the seat. So the rails are in other than one bolt that I have to get a washer for, that one. I did find a bolt for the back. That fits really good. This back's a bigger size for whatever reason. Uh, I'll show you guys. Big, not as good. I'm not sure why. But there's the FG2 seat, which is out. And the fixed back bride seat is what's going in. I have two, I need rails. I couldn't buy both rails and seats all at the same time. So basically I just gotta set the brackets into place. Everything's left loose right now. And then I uh, just gotta kinda do some adjusting, figure out where everything's gonna go and uh, it's gonna suck. So other than tightening the bottom bracket, the driver's side is in. What I'm talking about is the bolts from here. I did move it up to the second slot. I need to loosen this one and tilt this bracket a little bit to get it more toward the middle. But the seats are definitely a lot lower, a lot more comfy, a lot more snug. So 10 times better. And they look. So just a comparison, so there's the seat. There's the old one. I mean, look, you can probably tell just by looking that like the FG2 seats for one are ridiculously heavy. These are stupid light being fiberglass. Uh, way more snug, it's gonna hold you around. The cushions are detachable. Set up for harnesses, I mean all the brackets, everything fits well, sits super low, uh, obviously hence for the lowdown. The fiberglass backing looks phenomenal. Matches the FG2 rears. So when I get my other one in, the interior should look great. Held in the echoes, secrets that we know. Doors that open for us in a moment